Good evening, I'm Jeff Vallon. We begin tonight with new details of a deadly crash Friday night. JSO now tells us the death toll in the four car pileup on the west side has tonight reached five. That newest confirmed fatality is Evelyn Tyson, who was driving a Toyota Corolla at the intersection of US 90 and Otis Road. Her car crashed head on into a Jeep, which caught fire. Tyson and three others in the Toyota, including a 12 year old boy, died. Now, First Coast News, Bethany Anderson has learned more about the driver of the Jeep. She joins us from the newsroom with the latest. Bethany. She was a mother of two, and her family tells me that just before the accident, she dropped her children off. They tell me they're still trying to process this tragedy. 30-year-old Felicia Matos was killed Friday night after her Jeep collided head-on with another car carrying five people. As the crash remains under investigation, in a statement to First Coast News, Mato's family says she was a kind person that lit up a room, had a beautiful voice, and will be missed by so many. She leaves behind a nine-month-old son and four-year-old daughter. If you would like to help out with funeral expenses, we have provided a link to the GoFundMe account on our website, firstcoastnews.com. Reporting in the newsroom, Bethany Anderson, First Coast News, on your side.